Gerstein are allowed to just hit it up ball without a challenge. And then the driven shot! What a goal! Here is the planet's ultimate game. The final of the 21st Football World Cup. Griezmann, Pogba! Pogba! The breaking news in the last few minutes or so that Paul Pogba banned from football for four years. Paola Bila Pogba, player of Juventus, Serie A, and the French national team. We all know. Hey, I don't know how to do it. Right? <laughs> but the crazy thing about this, um, we're gonna check what his early life. Pogba was born in Lachny, Surimane, if I'm saying it correctly. It's uh, it's somewhere in France. I don't know if it's Paris. Tell me if I'm wrong or right, but it's somewhere in France, <laughs> definitely to both of the guinean parents and the crazy thing is everybody in the family is a baller you know he got two brothers twin brothers they both ballers that's crazy florentine pogba and matthias pogba but both of the brothers were born in guinea and they play for guinea florentine last played as a defender and he played for atk mohun bagan so yeah that's a Hard name. <laughs> well, Matthias is a forward and he played for ACM Belfort. I don't know where that is, but yeah. Growing up, Pogba was a fan of Arsenal. It's crazy that he went to Manchester United. But yeah, hey, you need to take it what you need to take, bro. Pogba joined when he was six years old, the club UC Rosse and Brie. And it was a few miles away south of his hometown. He spent seven seasons at the club before joining UC Torsi, where he served as captain under the under 30 team. Crazy. Captain already? Yeah. And after one season for killing it, he joined La Havre, the professional club in France. In the second of the season, he was as well the captain under the under 16. And they finished that season second as well. And he was killing it. He was so, so, so killing it that on 31 July 2009, Manchester United announced that they signing an academic player from La Havre, Pogba, to Manchester United england crazy here we go but the crazy thing was a lot of fuss with the transfer people were mad president was mad some clubs was mad i don't know what was the understanding but they said like they already had contact with pogba with the parents way back before he was at la havre but yeah they said they paid them stuff they said they gave pogba a house and stuff different things cost but yeah he went to Manchester United in the season 2009-2010 he made his debut and he made seven goals in 21 appearance crazy for midfielder that's crazy bro no cap on January 2011 Pogba showed his skills as well you know the long shot goals in the FI youth Cup, he described it as a power driver crazy but it doesn't stop there bro a month later Pogba did the same thing <laughs> in a 3-2 defeat versus West Bromwich Elliman in 2011 Alex Ferguson saw already a talent so he was like bro I'm gonna get four four guys from the youth to come here and train with us so yeah man crazy the crazy part about this is Sir Alex Ferguson saw already a lot of talent in Pogba the crazy thing that he said listen to this i mean if we hold pogba back what's gonna happen he's going to leave you know in a couple of years of times when his contract is finished so we gotta give him an opportunity to show what he's got in the first team crazy at 31 january 2012 pogba made his debut in the premier league crazy against stoke city unfortunately they lost that game but Pogba got his first debut, but on 3 July 2012, Sir Alex Ferguson confirmed that Pogba is going to Juventus. And again, there was a lot of fuss around that. Ferguson was kind of mad because he said it was already way back that they signed a deal. They had already contact with each other. But yeah, right now, this was his decision. And Ferguson said that Pogba was disrespecting them. So it was really disappointing about that. But yeah, Pogba went still, signed a four-year deal. But yeah, the crazy thing about this, I wouldn't know who Pogba was if he wouldn't go to Juventus. So I think it was really time for Pogba to 
spread his wings and show the world what he got so his first debut as well september 20 he played full 90 minutes versus shivo he scored as well his first goal versus napoli as well he was killing it man got named in 2013 for golden boy the best play in europe guardian named him as one of the most promising young talent but yeah he was killing it scoring assist assist back to back to back that first season they finished with the title as well and they went to the semi-finals of the european league but let's go forward after killing four season at juventus with 124 appearance 28 goals and six goals as well we went back 2016 to manchester united for me that was the moment that it went downhill bro no cap and 2016 oh that was a crazy crazy appearance with storms hey 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 that was crazy bro but at the moment he got the highest prize for a player 105 million the record holder was garrett bill by the way and he surpassed that sick but yeah after a long time there as well for he spent like six seasons there that's crazy 154 appearance and 29 goals he came back he came back so the first season that he came he had a great season the second season that he came more but the third season it went downhill after that he thought bro let me go back better to juventus man on 11 july 2022 juventus signed him and announced it but as well he was injured with his knee two months and that injury ruled him as well to go to 2022 world cup he made his debut on 28 february 2023 that was last year that's crazy but on 9 march he was dropped the reason why he didn't came to um a meeting oh he came to the meeting but he turned up late to the meeting but four days later they heard he got a muscle injury it will be out for three weeks so this crazy thing is he only played 161 minutes last year and the crazy thing comes on 11 september 2023 he got suspended for a foul drug test a non-endangered testosterone was found in his foul so on 29 february 2024 he get a four-year ban that's crazy bro and then your career is done just at that moment bro sick hey he's only 31 eh? that's sick as well I thought he was older, bro. But yeah, it was, bro. Sick, man. He got a lot of things. So I think I need to make a part two of Pogba because this is all long already. But yeah, let's check his style of play. And after that, let's go to another one. Pogba is primarily a central midfielder. He's also capable of playing left flank and also as a deep lying playmaker or even as an attacking midfielder. Pogba was described at Manchester United as a powerful, skillful player and very creative player. He got named in Italy as Paul Octopus because his long legs. <laughs> crazy but he's physically strong as well large quick and very hard working he got compared a lot to patrick vieira one of the legends in france so yeah let's check out his highlights let's get it Yeah, that was his highlights, man. I definitely need to make a part two of this, but yeah, let's get it. Pop Pogba. <laughs> 